Our next guest has a vision to reach out to others to spread messages of hope, inspiration, and self-confidence. She is an innovator. She is an entrepreneur. She is an inspirational speaker. She is an author. She's not even in high school yet. We would like to introduce to you this afternoon, Kidpreneur Ariana Fox. It's nice Thank to you. meet you. Very nice Actually, to meet we've you met well. you before. You've been on the show before. Yes, I have with my parents who are marriage coaches, Mike and Trisha Fox. That's right. Okay, so we're here to talk about you today. Now, I gotta ask you about this. Your experience in leadership started when your parents made you the junior marketing director for the family business, right? <laughs> yes, that's correct. And how old are you? <laughs> I'm 12. 12, okay. Oh my goodness. So what was the family business and what was your job? Well, um, actually the family business is still going and it is Splash Design Works. And um, I was actually the junior marketing director probably when I was around six years old, actually. <laughs> um, I was just going to, following my parents around in mixers and even um, giving my spiel to people. Um, wow. Wow. Yeah. At six. Okay, so that inspired you to want to motivate others to achieve their goals, uh, business goals. So you started a business called Big Ideas Kid Coaching. Yes. <laughs> That's right. What it, tell us about what it. it. So basically, Big Ideas Key Coaching is a business for inspiring people on a professional level. So it's actually for inspirational speaking, authoring, um, inspiring people, basically. So. And you have been a keynote speaker for many organizations. You got to listen to this. Th these events around the region: Northern Star Children's Foundation, the Delaware Multicultural and Civic Organization. What what is that like? Uh, amazing, actually. It's, I, I'm so I just love inspiring people, and yeah. that I love being able to impact somebody's life and change their life forever. I, there's, it's like the saying I came up with: to shine, right. shine a light, light a spark, spark a fire. Wow. I could use some of your services no, because I, I have I have problems talking yeah. to people. Okay, but you said once in an interview with uh, Milford Live that you want kids to not be afraid to dream big and see that they can easily overcome obstacles like shyness, the fear of failure, and putting too much time and thought into what others think. We need you. How, how do you how do you um, overcome things like that? Well, you overcome obstacles just you by knowing that you they don't set you back. In fact, mistakes are a part of the journey. What I like to tell people a lot is that you only fail when you give up. That you only fail when you give up and that mistakes are just a part of the journey. You just dust off and keep going. And keep going. <laughs> yes. You are incredible. You are an author. You have a book called The Princess Chronicles, Not Your Average Princess. Is Indeed. that what this one is? Yep. Wait, what is it? Tell me what this is about. That, that is about pr these princesses who are friends and they're learning kindness, friendship, forgiveness, all those important qualities, trust, teamwork, honesty. Wow. And that's not the only book that you've written. No, not at all. That's actually just a children's book. In fact, my other book is called False Awakening. And that is a novel which is for teens and young adults. And that is a fiction novel um, about a man who's in a dream within a dream within a dream. Ooh, wow. Yep, he joins the rebellion and fights against an evil tyrant. I like the sound of that. Okay, <laughs> in addition to all of that, you're also a monthly contributor to a magazine called Kish. Um, what are the, some of the topics you write about? All kinds of things. Actually, a lot of the topics that I speak about as well, um, My, I think my most recent one was Rise of the Young Entrepreneurs, mm -hmm. which is about um, young, as the, as the title may suggest, uh, young kidpreneurs who are um, basically succeeding in their life and rising up to be stars. Um, a lot of my other ones are just about the same kind of topics, overcoming fear, overcoming obstacles, achieving your success. Wow. <laughs> I'm almost afraid to ask this question. What are your plans for the future? <laughs> well, we, my overall goal, to be honest with you, is just to inspire people and to impact them, to set them on a new, in a new direction and change them for the rest of their lives. So do you, what do you see yourself when you do become an adult, what, what do you aspire to do? I don't even know. I, well, I, I'm a, I've always wanted to be an author, mm -hmm. um, but I actually am. So <laughs> You already hit that goal. <laughs> yeah, so I guess, my, my, I guess what I aspire to be is just to write more books, to have lots of published books, I guess, in the future. I think that's going to happen. I right. have a funny feeling that's going to happen. Ariana Fox, a kidpreneur, Thank author, so speaker, much. just overall 
great person. Overall, Thank you for wow. being here. Yeah. Thank you for having me. You're welcome. Our pleasure. <laughs>